Another fun thing I like to do on Starship Mario is to bounce up on this sign and, and try to bounce right onto the helm. Yeah, it's not it's not exactly that fun, but still. Hey everybody, it's the Mechmaster 14. Welcome back to more Super Mario Galaxy 2. In the last episode, we tackled quite a few more prankster comets, and in this episode. We're going to be tackling what'll hopefully be the last of the prankster comments for a while because I want to continue on to a new galaxy. And we're going to tackle Hightail Falls' comment. Alright, hopefully this will be the last or maybe second to last comment we tackle in a while. Because I, I really want to head on to one of the new galaxies in World 3. Alright, so we have three minutes to complete this course. And also, a kind of a pretty new detail in this is that the course is all broken apart and stuff because of these meteors that are flying down. Not sure why exactly there is meteors, but hey. Definitely makes things more interesting. Alright, so that wasn't too bad. Right, let's get up here. Hopefully we don't run out of time. Alright, that wasn't even close. There we go. Alright. We definitely we're de we definitely got it this time. Alright, we have two minutes left. And I kind of spit everywhere when I said that. Yeah, you really, you really gotta be careful this time because of all the holes that are here. Again, not sure why there are, not sure why there's so many holes here, but it definitely makes things a lot more interesting. And also meteor. Meteors make things more interesting too. Let's get up here. That's where the comet metal would be, but th that this time there was a one up there. No, 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 no! Oh, saved it. Oh, we're, we're down to a minute, and I had kind of a lot of trouble getting past that. All right, you know, this took me a, this took us a lot of tries on the first playthrough. I'm gonna try to get up there. Oh, I don't think we're I don't think we're gonna make it this time. I don't think we're gonna make it. I don't think we're gonna make it. Oh, no, there's no way. Yeah, and that's what happens if you fail a speed run. You die. All right, so let's try that again. I was gonna, I was gonna bump my head off the edge right there. I, I really shouldn't have tried to keep getting up there without the pepper. Although I don't know why my side flips weren't working because I swear I was doing side flips. All right, this time we're gonna have to move lightning fast. Also, it makes me, it makes me upset that I managed to save, I managed to save the thing, right, right when we were getting to the flowers. Like, I managed to save kind of the whole run, right when we were at the flowers, 
and then I and then I failed it later on. Like that that makes me kind of irritated. Again, we should have a lot more time this time. And hopefully not fail. Also, I kinda got screwed up when that meteor hit us. Yo, I blame I blame the meteor for us failing. It's all the meteor's fault. Let's get going. Hopefully not fail this time. Dang it. All right, we're going. We're going to have to. Do we can't do that little trick that we used the first time. We're going to have to actually use the pepper. There we go. I was worried we weren't going to get it again. But anyway, that's kind of the whole speed run. Sorry that it took. Sorry that it took me a couple tries. But hopefully, this is the last of the comments for a while. But I think there might be one more. Alright, that's actually the galaxy complete. And no, no more pranks or comments. Alright, all right, so let's zoom back to World 3. There's no more... Alright, no more pranks or comments here. No more, more, no more here. And there's two new galaxies that we've yet to explore in World 3. Because there, because there are so many pranks or comments. So let's head to the Haunty Halls galaxy. At least I think that's the name of the galaxy. Yeah, Haunty Hall's galaxy. A glimmer of bulb berry. Alright, I actually kind of remember this mission being kind of long. So, yes. this may be the only other mission we tackle today. Alright, so we have these little Octoboos. Basically, if you spin, if you spin into them, they kind of go invisible and they can't hurt you. So that's that's nice. There's a little challenge over there, but I'm not going to do it because, I, like I said, this mission's kind of long, and I and I want to be able to complete it. All right, so there's these moving platforms that'll go into the portals and then come out on the other side. Alright, let's just do a few long turns to get past this, because I don't want to wait. Alright, now that should come out on this side. Yes! Screw the one up, we don't need it. This one comes really fast. Oh, we might not make it this time. Actually, I think we I think we got this. Yep, there's the end. All right, let's get through here, up some stairs. Now, I don't think we want to go in that pipe just yet, because that takes us to the new part of the level. Yeah. What we want to do is we want to go out here and get the Comet Medal. And then we want to go in the pipe. Because I think once we go in the pipe... Yeah, we can't go back. Alright, so, so we have another Yoshi mission. We eat this thing, it's the, it's the Bulb Berry, and that, uh, that reveals a secret path. Now the bulb berry is kind of a lame, it's kind, it's kind of the lamest of the Yoshi fruits. Like it just reveals another path and there's, and there's a time limit. 
Like you, like you can probably hear this. You can probably hear that taking that just that just tells you how much time you have left until the bulb berry runs out and the path beneath you kinda disappears. Again, not the most exciting of the Yoshi fruits, but still eh. It's just not very exciting. Does make for does make for some kind of interesting level design though. I guess that level wasn't very long because that didn't take very that didn't take as long as I thought it would. Yeah, I, I didn't really have that much to say about the whole bulb berry. Yeah, glimmer of bulb berry. Starship Mario can now advance. I think we should have time for the for the other mission in Haunty Hall's Galaxy. And I'm pretty sure. Actually, I'm not too sure whether there's a prankster comet or secret star here. All right, so sneaking down the creepy corridor. Alright, this shit I don't think this mission is quite as long as the other one, so we should be we should be pretty good. Oh, what does this say? The booze won't hurt you as long as you don't as long as you don't look at them in the eye, okay? <laughs> that looks like it was written by a boo. And also speaking of booze, yep, if you look the if you look the booze right in the eye, then they won't come after you. But as soon as you stop, they'll start charging. Yeah. Alright, so nice to have a checkpoint. Also, boost. They can't really be defeated by any normal attack. If you spin into them, then they kind of just move around you and you can't jump on them. So all you can really do to stop booze is just look at them and they won't come after you. But other than that, there's really no way to defeat booze. The only way to defeat, the only two ways to defeat a boo is to shine them under a beam of light, which we'll get into in a future mission, I think. And also, you can hit into them with a rainbow star. All right, get into the sling star, and I'm pretty sure we're already pretty close to the end. We got these little floor eaters here. I believe, I believe we already saw them in the first Bowser level, so no need to explain them again. Although I do kind of like to long jump off their heads, which is pretty fun. Don't fall. Don't fall. Also, I didn't say this in, when we first saw these little floor eaters, but they look so similar to dry bones. Like, if you look at their heads, they look just like the head of a dry bone. Alright, so we have some more boos. They're gonna charge after us at kind of a slow speed. Again, look at them to prevent them from moving. Although there's not too much point to that since we're already at the star. And that's it! You got a star! There's our 40th star. And no more prankster comments. Okay. So that's all the time we're going to have for this for this video. Next time on Super Mario Galaxy 2, we'll we'll be exploring some more new galaxies and hopefully not doing any more prankster comments. Because as much as much as I love the prankster comments, I do want to move on to some new galaxies. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you can like, comment, and subscribe, that would really help out the channel. And with that, I'll see you guys next time. Mech Master. Woo!